that shit. What? Shake that I, shit. Where the f was Ice Spice booty? Ice Spice. Hey, what the fuck is 4Dig, bro? Hold the fuck up. What the fuck they on? They on the 4Dig? Now nah, her booty did disappear. What the fuck? I can't even see that bitch no more. I'm still going to crack. I still go crack Ice Spice, though. And y'all know it. Where the f was Ice Spice booty? Ice Spice, well, a woman booty. not famous for her amazing album sales, her incredible vernacular when it came to interviews, or maybe her amazing lyricism when asked to freestyle. But by the way, that jumped anytime she hopped on stage, a stream, or basically did anything. Come on, shake it. 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 Hey. I don't know if you could tell, but in that clip, Kai asked her to freestyle and she responded by turning around and twerking. Yeah. Hey, hey you see, the, 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 the hoes be like this. Oh, y'all only want a, y'all only want a bitch for their body. Bitch, I asked you to do something you want to twerk. I asked you to do a test that don't involve you using your body and you want to twerk. What the fuck, bitch? Obviously, y'all won't be the judge y'all for y'all body, and I don't have a problem for it. If you just want me to just see you just for your body, I would do that shit. But just don't be twerking and shit all day. And then a nigga, and then a nigga just want you for the twerking and, and your cheeks and shit. Now you mad? Stop twerking all day, then, shorty. Make some good songs. So a lot of people are saying her career is done. But let me start from the very beginning, starting with who even is Ice Spice? She is a female rapper from the Bronx who started blowing up because of her song called Munch, which took people by storm on basically any social media platform because you could not escape the words, you thought I was feeling you, that nigga a munch. And basically everybody was saying it. Not gonna lie, you catch me slipping here and there because that was really catchy. Fun fact about Munch that I don't think Hey, go cap. That song was catchy, bro. Hey, not, hey, motherfuckers can't bap like that Ice Spice song did get stuck in their head for a little second. Like, you feel me? You thought I was feeling you? That bitch is a munch. On gang, these hoes be munches, bro. They be eating the dick up on gang and act like they don't do that shit. I think everybody knows is I recorded it in my room and it took me like an hour. I was like, I'm not going to oh, think too wrong. long this you one. Wrong. I'm just have fun. It just came line by line. It started picking up, picking up. And then, you know, of course, Drake co-signed too. So like, it just blew up. Not everybody gets to like actually make a hit. And even for me, I was just like, I got a hit. Like, that's crazy. And because of this song and this virality on TikTok, she got noticed by more than just Drake. Also getting noticed by Ruby Rose and basically fast-tracking her entire career. I mean, she was able to get more Billboard 100 hits than most artists. Amassing a bunch of cosigns and features that people could only dream of. Like a Taylor Swift feature, Nicki Minaj, and Travis Scott. Amassing millions of followers on every single platform. YouTube, Instagram twitter everybody seemed to love her well not really her but her look but i'll talk more about that a little bit later right now she has fallen from that former grace that she had where she has been in a public feud with other rappers multiple might i add one of them being drake and having a album sale that basically went double tin for you and constantly double tin and don't be playing with my little boo ice spice bro first of all my shorty did what she had to do on oh, gang, she didn't shake enough ass for that video for the album to go up. That's all. Don't play with her. She if she shakes some more ass, she go, man, think about it. She didn't even shake that much ass and she sold twenty eight thousand. Fuck are you talking about? Stop playing with my shorty ice spice, bro. I got you bookie on gang. When I get that Birkin bag money, it's coming to you, Ice Spice. Don't worry. I'm lying like a motherfucker loses thousands if not millions of followers every single day and a lot of you might be sitting here wondering i mean how can someone just lose all of those followers and everybody that loved her that quickly well because she's not good at music and when your main talent is supposed to be you being a rapper being bad at rapping means your fall off is just inevitable she just wasn't the best lyricist out there and had a continuous trend of mentioning a certain type of things in her song Oh, I Spice dropped a new song. Mm, let's listen. Why not? I just did a fart and a poop at the same time. I call that a foop. My so big. Dang, on Capsi, that bitch do be talking about farting and pooping and all types of 
freaky ass shit. That's why I be asking Ice Spice. Like, do you be pooting Ice Spice? Tell the truth, Ice Spice. Do you be pooting when you be twerking? I, I think you be pooting when you be twerking, Ice Spice. That's why this shit be so relatable to you. All I do is sh My poop is so smelly. It's looking like jelly. I just want to fart. I'm breaking their hearts. It gets to a point, no hawk to a podcast though. And it's so bad that even Complex, yes, Complex, the major rap reporters have an article ranking all of her poop related bars in her latest album. But that's not really the issue though. Well, not a big one. And you could talk about the same thing over and over again and still make it catchy and have people like it. The issue is it all sounds the same. I mean, it's basically like the fast food of music. If you went to a fast food restaurant and decided to never go back there again though, not to say that every single one of her songs is bad and again munch did blow up but it blew up for that one line if this video didn't get copyrighted i would literally show you the concert where people were dead silent until that one part came up and bro let's be real though can can anyone name a ice spice song outside of munch let's be real who the fuck can name an ice spice song outside of munch no one can't do that shit because no one gives a fuck about motherfucking Ice Spice music. I'm not finna sit here and bap to you, bro. Can't no one name an Ice Spice song. Only motherfucker we know is Munch. That's the only song I can name by motherfucking Ice Spice. And if someone can name another Ice Spice song, I bet you it's a feature. I bet you it's a feature. Can't no one name no other Ice Spice song, my nigga. I want to see that bitch talk. And people went silent again because that's really the only line people knew from her one song. And then her song with Pete Panthers was not bad either. But then again, it's kind of just the exact same flow, the exact same type of beats. As I said, the fast food of music, not really good, doesn't even really look that good, and barely even appetizing to listen to. Someone please explain to me why Ice Spice, like all of her songs, sound the exact same. Switch it up bro like well if she's a rapper and basically her whole job is supposed to be making music and rapping how is she still famous how do people still like her and how does she get to this magnitude well that would be because of her looks and her body and she uses that to gain her fame really ask anybody what do you know about ice spice the person the extent of which we know ice spice is she is pretty she has a fat ass she's from new york she's from the bronx she's Dominican and Nigerian. That's the extent of which we know. Her. I didn't even know that. I didn't even know most of that shit, gay. I know Ice Spice is a little cute, light skinned girl that that, that that had that little rubber dump dump, and now she on that exempic shit supposedly, and now she's skinny as hell. Either way, whether Ice Spice got the big booty, the small booty, I'm fucking. Let's start there. Now, can someone get Ice back? Ice Spice. Contact information, please. And thank you. I need that shit ASAP. Y'all ass probably don't get her information, bro. I don't know why I asked y'all. Her because if you go back and you watch any interview, you go on any of her lives, she's offered us no substance about herself. We do not know Ice Spice. You cannot say you connect to Ice Spice based upon her personality. No, you connect to Ice I Spice. I connect to her, her booty. Mannerisms and the way she looks. <laughs> I you connect to her like booty. Ice Spice. They say, oh, well, she's a pretty girl from New York. You ask a man why you like Ice Spice. I mean, well, she look good and that's she be jumping that ass be fanging do you even know her real name because i didn't i had to look that up before making this video but if i'm being honest all ice spice really does let's be real most people don't know rappers real name bro like i know for a fact i don't know most come on now come on now unless unless the motherfucker like you feel me they name always being said bro like i don't know lots of the rappers i listen to like, unless these niggas, like, be making songs and shit. Like, you know, some rappers like to, like, go through this stage in their career where they want to uh, make their shit more about them and they want to use their real name. Like, NLD Chopper did that shit talking about Bryson. They be like, Bryson, boy. Like, bro, what the fuck is you? Like, like and, then, and, then, and, then, and then NBA Young Boy did that shit. Did the whole, did the shit called Contrail. Contrail, you got a man that you had out of a kid. Contrail, you got a... You feel me? So shit like that, that's how I be knowing motherfucking names when they do shit like that. But if they don't do no shit like that, I'm not gonna know their name. Let's be real. What the fuck is Lil TJ name? What the fuck is Polo G name? What the fuck is the baby name? Oh, 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 oh no, I think his shit is... No, I think that's his dad name. 
on gang. So I don't even know what the baby name is. Unless it's up on stage. Throw that back and people will look at it mesmerized and hypnotized i mean honestly if she wasn't doing that and you actually genuinely sat there to go to her concert to listen to her music i might think you were mentally insane not to say that she doesn't have any fans obviously people who are popular are gonna mess fans regardless who actually do like her and probably do know things about her now can i tell you what those things are hell no because the extent to her interviews are like this my plan is to just be like very successful. I feel like I always seen success for me. It's a Capricorn thing. I feel like we're just very hardworking. Bitch, shut the fuck up. You see when a bitch get to talking about that Zodiac shit. Bitch, shut the fuck up. What the fuck is you talking about, shut? I be having to tell my ex this shit. I be like, bro, y'all be, be saying some dumb ass shit with the Zodiac shit. She be like, man, it's woo woo. I be like, okay, it's true. It's just that Gemini in you, I guess. That's why you, it's that Gemini. Okay. Get the fuck out of here, man. And like goal oriented and like obsessed with money a little bit. You could probably hear that in my songs, but yeah. As I said, no real. I think everybody is obsessed with money. Like, like everybody is obsessed with money. They just don't know how to get it. I'm pretty sure everybody is obsessed with money. You see, motherfuckers said the most general trait. They'd be like, oh yeah, it's a part of my Zodiac. No, I'm, I'm pretty sure that's just what everybody like, bro. Okay substance but at least she was still hot until she wasn't which is kind of crazy because obviously she isn't unattractive but recently she started losing some weight and the entire internet noticed and basically piled on top of her to clown and make fun of her it ain't gonna cap it is it's not hitting the same no more like, cause, cause it's like ice spice. It's when we used to have it, you used to be like, ah, God, and you used to be shaking this shit. Yeah, yeah. What the fuck is this, ice spice? Your, your, your music, your, your music ain't gonna, ain't gonna be able to sell. The, the body ain't, ain't bodying, man. You gotta get to shaking. Now, me personally, I like the little petite, you feel me? Like, me personally, I, I personally just think ice spice. Look better with her little thickness on her, but you feel me? Either way, she look good to me. I ain't, I ain't finna sit here and bap to you, bro. I like petite girls. But the hairstyle, hairstyle going on right now, bro, I ain't gonna bap to you. Now, I don't think she looks unattractive. I'm not gonna say that, but people's biggest issue was, where is the ice now? Literally coining the phrase, the ice has melted, because before this, she at least had something to throw back. Now, her biggest asset, and depending on who you ask, her only asset was gone. <laughs> Hey, I like the little petite look on gang. I must definitely nail her ass, bro. Besides people literally just saying that she has no more ass to throw back anymore, she was also being accused of taking Ozempic, which if you don't know, is just a that's meant to be for diabetes that a lot of people use to become skinnier, basically making you lose your appetite. And with her posting some workout videos to prove- Oh, I don't need no Ozempic, bro. I don't get hungry. I promise you, man. I could barely eat. I'll be spending money on shit. Hell, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. My body don't work. I ain't gonna count. My body been fucked up for a long time, gang. That's why I'm so skinny. I can't even gain weight at this point, bro. Prove that she actually does go ahead and work out. I never seen this bitch work out till a motherfucker said she was on no zip it. But I right, shorty do your shit. Go ahead, do it. Do it. Ooh. Ooh. What up? Ooh. Ooh. Hey, hey. Hey. Hey, y'all said Ice Spice don't got it. When she looking like that, she most definitely got it. Okay, man. Give me some money so I can get Ice Spice a Birkin bag, bro. That's all I got to do. Once I get the Birkin bag money, I got Ice Spice. I'm trying to tell y'all, bro.
now does she take those or not i don't know honestly don't care and if she doesn't then that's good for her she felt like losing weight and decided to do it the only issue with that is now when you're inside your personality is quite literally using your body to promote your music once you lose that figure that people fell in love with it's gonna be kind of hard to get back into people's eyes without that because if someone like t grizzly was to go out and lose a bunch of weight a lot of people would probably just compliment him be happy for him and still listen to his music because that's mainly what they're there for personally i'm not there to watch t grizzly throw ass back and i would pray to god that if i ever went to a show of his he would never do that please it would probably no that's what that, no like the truth bro like you let's be real you think motherfuckers ain't gonna stop listening to rod wave if you got skinny because no one don't bro like that shit don't make them but ice spice bro your booty is what make you so make that thing shake <laughs> i ain't gonna cap to you gotta learn how to make that bitch shake we just continue going on that same downhill trend with her losing monthly listeners followers and a lot of people just not liking her as they used to now will she still keep a portion of her fan base obviously yes but something has to give either she's gonna gain that weight back and keep using her body again so that people will continue to like her or she might just go back to the lab and try to focus on making some really good music now which one of those options will prevail who knows and we only have to see sorry to leave it on the cliffhanger but that is kind of life i am not miss cleo and can't tell the future on game ice spice i, I ain't go cap i feel like motherfucker be overdoing it with the ice spice shit i i i like how she looked now bro like and i like how she looked back then you feel me now would i prefer her back then yeah but her right now it ain't you feel me but i like girls with that type of body type though you you feel i never was like you feel me like i like thick girls but i never really dated or like thick girl you feel me i always fuck thick girls but all my girls that i fuck with they be like working out in the gym like you feel me built like how ice spice was built when she was in the gym type shit like that's how most of my females that i date be you feel me now what what i fuck well i'm fucking a b-dub depending on the day the bbw <laughs> you feel me but that's for another day bro if you watch this video all the way through I know your ass fucking with another motherfucking video. So go ahead and watch another motherfucking video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Turn on post notifications so you never miss out on any content like this. Go!